I just woke up and today I decided that I want to organize all of my art supplies as well as my room. I've been doing a lot lately, like way too much for me and my mental health and my area has been suffering as a result of it. Like some of my plants are dying over there. We don't, we don't talk about them. Like all of this is out of control. I literally have like markers in the same container with all my brushes and stuff. And that might not seem like a big deal, but I literally like organized them all and took like an entire day to do it like a year ago. So it's time to do that again. Come with me and we're gonna organize all of it. Just kidding. I actually started out my day doing a little bit of watercolor and gouache painting. I've wanted to get better at realism. And now I gotta tackle that. So there's a lot to unpack here. Um, a bunch of art, a bunch of art supplies. Um, my full tuition letter from Meredith College. I think that I'm just gonna start off by like throwing anything away that can be thrown away. And then the rest that can't, I will focus on organizing. I started out with just moving some art pieces off my table. I actually have been creating like a decent amount lately. I thought that I wasn't because I wasn't, okay, I just dropped that. Wasn't really posting stuff on my art Instagram, but I actually have been making things. So then I started organizing my desk. I was trying to put all of my watercolors and gouache paints in one corner of my desk. And then I moved on to trying to like sort out my pens and my brushes and markers into the correct cups and stuff like that. I have some little mini sketchbooks which I like keep in the corner of my desk for when I might need to go on vacation and stuff like that. So here are the little cups that I was talking about. Normally I have them organized to where like one is brushes and one is pens but when I get lazy I kind of just put stuff back like wherever I think that it needs to be instead of like what it actually is. So I'm glad I'm organizing. The two in the front, we have pens and pencils, then markers, then brushes, and then supplies. Just random supplies. The final desk in all her glory. Very cute, very stylish. Okay, now we have my little plants and trinkets table. Um, as I said earlier, a couple of the plants are dead, but I focus on that later. I moved a couple of them out of my room, actually. So I also have a bunch of little animal figurines and crystals, and I'm trying to kind of figure out, like, where I should put them all, because sometimes this becomes a junk desk. I moved all of my crystals to one big bowl, and they look a lot cuter in there. And here is the final product. I made a little space on a table for a lot of the art that I didn't really have space for before. So this is the entire space. There's my main desk where I work, where I have my computer, do schoolwork, whatever. Sometimes I paint there. And then there's my little trinket table beside it with all my plants. It's so cute, so cozy, I love it. Hey again, I'm back after all that and it's nighttime, I'm doing designing. Okay, so I have an art exhibition coming up that I curated this weekend. And this is the cute little poster I made for it, I love it. I also made this little brochure thing that I'll be able to like cut down the middle. This one will probably like go on the door and then the brochures will be passed out to people. I am like so so excited to do this. It's my second exhibition that I've curated with the Youth and Art Initiative which is like my little service project that I've been doing. That's just awesome. Like I'm literally wow it's happening. So this week I have to go to three art shows. Okay, but I'm like actually really excited. Thursday um, is my county's high school art showcase, which I have one piece in. And then Friday is my IB art exhibition, which I've literally been making stuff for for like two years. It's big. That's at my high school. And then I'm also really excited because I think that I'm gonna on the same day be having some people come to see my Saturday exhibition early so I will try to set that up tomorrow and then on Saturday is this exhibition joy unfiltered expect to have like a lot of vlogging content in the next little while because it's gonna be like our show after our show after our show you guys are getting to see my collection of all the little fuzzy headbands I have you know what fuzzy headband tour 
I think that I was wearing the cow one this morning. I literally don't know where it went. But there's this white one. Purple. Pink with a bow. Reindeer ears. Antlers. And then this like little blue one with like creatures on it. I also have like a Hello Kitty one and that's my favorite and it's been lost somewhere for like a week. I'm gonna end my artsy day by just like sketching a little bit. I think that it really helps me like unwind after a long day. Especially because today was like supposed to be an off day for me but normally I end up using my off days to do like a lot of like work for my service project and just like my art stuff in general not a bad thing sometimes it's fun if i'm just doing like silly little sketches i'll normally find the reference on pinterest otherwise i normally try to just like take my own pictures or friends and stuff because a lot of the work that i do is for my ib art exhibition or to be entered in exhibitions in the future and if you don't already know there are a lot of very strange rules in the art world you can't really use things that you found online even reference them it is kind of a hard experience so halfway through that first sketch, I like flipped it over and like started a new one because I really didn't like what I was doing, even though it's like just a small little sketch and it's very insignificant in the grand scheme of things. But here I am working on it now. I love drawing just like cool looking girls, like it's super fun. So yeah, another angle just of me drawing the same girl. I really try to like develop my own style and not just rely on my own realism all the time. I think it's important. And there she is. It's kind of nice to be able to just like relax and not have to worry about making some big elaborate piece like I normally do and just drawing something just to draw. So yeah, with that, that is the end of today's art video. I was able to work pretty hard today and I also took a lot of breaks. I took a walk. There was a lot of stuff that I didn't get on camera, made some really good food. But yeah, I will have a lot of art content coming out very, very soon because there are many exciting things happening in life right now. But until then, have a great day, a great life, and make some really, really cool art. Bye!